Hi, welcome back to LGS Microscopes. My name is Paul and today we're going to show you how to unbox a brand new microscope. First, obviously we have to open up the box, so we're going to take our box cutter and obviously be very careful. I don't want to cut too deep so you don't damage anything inside. Here you're going to have your manual. And this is taped together, so you want to be careful. Okay, now you've got some tape around the edge here, and you might want to cut it, but it's actually easier to just grab the beginning of the tape and peel it off. There we go. Okay, take this part off. Make sure there's nothing in the top there. Alright, flip this around so it's easier to see. Here's the main microscope, and this is just a temporary cover, so you can pull this off. Next, we're going to pull these covers off. Now, these eyepieces, they're going to have these plastic covers and a rubber band. The easiest way to do it is to grab behind this and peel it up. Otherwise, your rubber band can get snapped into these little narrow grooves and it's kind of difficult to get it off. Okay. Okay, now down here, this is called the collector lens. And it also has a rubber band, so you want to try to peel it up and get the rubber band with it. And then this foam piece, sometimes people miss this, and it makes it so the stage can't go down. It's a packing precaution. So you just raise the stage all the way up, pull that out. Okay, we've got a few other goodies in here. These are some tools. We'll get into those later. This is your power cord. Standard power cord connection. You might see these on computers or monitors or most electronics have this same power cord. This microscope is made by AccuScope, so you'll get a cover with their logo on it. And over here we have some immersion oil that you'll need for your 100x objective. Here's some lens paper and your condenser. So I'll show you how to install this condenser here. Okay, now we're going to install the condenser. So first you want to make sure that your objectives, you're on the 4x objective because it's the farthest away from the stage. We want to raise the stage all the way up using the course focus over here or on the other side. So now we're going to take our condenser and if you line it up to where it says 40x and put that in the middle, that's usually a good way to start. Now we're going to come around to this side and lower this condenser carrier and you'll notice there's a knob right here. It's pushed all the way in for shipping so we want to unscrew it a good bit and you can feel on the inside where it push, pushes now we're just going to take this, again line up the 40x with this little hole right here, tighten it down, and you're good to go. Just finger tight is fine, you can raise it back up. Okay, now we're going to adjust the diopters. Now on the top of each eyepiece you'll notice there's this line right here, and then you've got hash marks with numbers on here, so you just want to set those to zero. And you can always check out our video on how to use a diopter if you have any questions on that. So just set those to zero. And finally you want to plug in the power of course. So there's only one way it'll go. Just plug it in there. Plug this into your nearest outlet. And flip it around. And flip the switch make sure your light comes on. It might take a second because this is LED. So you've got your power supply or power switch on this side and on this side you've got your intensity. Turns up and down. Alright now back to this little bag of tools that we got. We've got a couple of different Allen wrenches that are used for different things on the microscope. You shouldn't need to adjust anything right out of the box. This is a tool for adjusting the focus tension and you can reference our video on how to adjust the focus tension if you have any questions about that. 
Okay, now we're ready to get started and use the microscope. Now, if you remember, when we installed the condenser, we had to raise the stage all the way up, so I'm just going to move it down with the coarse focus here, back into what we call first position, put my stage or my slide in the stage holder, or the slide holder, rather, line it up, turn it on, and we can go ahead and start using it. Now you want to check it when it's out of the box because you just want to make sure everything works properly but almost every time you should be fine. This model is the AccuScope 3000 LED. LED bulbs tend to last a lot longer and you get a much truer color with this white light here. There's also another version of this microscope that has a camera attached on top as you can see here. If you're interested in getting a camera to attach to your microscope just contact us and we can certainly help with that. All right, now you're unboxed and you're ready to go. If you ever have any questions, you can always email us at info at lgsmicroscopes.com or you can call us at 623-240-2232. Thanks.